Hey there everyone. Today we have a visitor and she is enjoying the puppies. Uh -huh. <laughs> now do you have your pup with you right now? No. Or? I'm actually not sure which one this is. <laughs> that may be one of the boys. There we go. He's a cutie patootie. You want the owl? And Miss Ginger owl? and Jane. Well, we are kind of enjoying the outdoors. Justin and Malachi went to the store. We're going to be going to Grandma's today. And then um, Gwenny went down for a nap a few minutes ago. So I'm going to try to steal these few minutes to get some stuff planted in the garden. And what I wanted to show you real quick are the... Um, well, it's a surprise that I got from Mom and Dad. They went wild crafting, they went foraging, and found at a an abandoned house, a long time ago farmhouse that's near their area, um, some wild garlic. Well, I say wild. It was cultivated garlic that has gone wild. And it's essentially an elephant garlic. And they've planted theirs um, fairly recently. And Dad uh, sent me a text message yesterday saying it's already three inches tall. So it may not be too late to plant these. And either way, we're going to do the experiment and put them in the ground and see how they do. Um, if you noticed or remembered from our last video, we planted our garlic on um, St. Patty's Day. So now we're going to do the elephant truly heritage heirloom garlic um, on Easter weekend. Now the reason I say it's truly heirloom is because that house has been like falling apart <laughs> since I was a kid and I'm now 34 <laughs> years old. <laughs> I'm in my mid 30s and so um, I'm sure that house was there at minimum 30 years prior and nobody has lived there since I was a kid well since before um, I was a kid so this garlic has probably been growing there a minimum of 50 years and anything that's that hardy that continually grows without any kind of maintenance or and care and just um, thrives on its own that's some stuff I want in my garden so we're going to plant these and um, I'm not going to have you sit there and have to watch that process. You can go to our other video of planting garlic if you want to see how we do that. But um, I will definitely give you an update throughout the season to let you know how that garlic is doing because I'm really excited and I want to know how well this will do here in, on Cooker Gehoofed because our soil is a different soil type than where it normally grows so we will see if it will naturalize you know adapt and naturalize here because i would love to have this gigantic garlic growing here i mean can't beat that that's pretty awesome all right y'all have a blessed day and we will see you next time